While we love watching great swimmers from above, as you can see here, Matt is so incredibly aggressive with his stroke, there's not a lot that can be seen. Some of the things that you can see will be to look for the position of the head on the breakout and how it doesn't change from that point. Young swimmers can learn a lot from watching how he doesn't breathe right away, but continues the great line from the streamline into the breakout. The hips are always right on the surface, visible through just about the entire stroke cycle. While we already know how aggressive his kick is, the feet aren't breaking through the surface to the point where you can see the entire foot. The kick isn't just narrow under the water, but also doesn't waste energy by being too high above the water. If you look very closely, you can see Matt take a breath on this sprint. You'll never see his mouth and have to question if you really did get any air. However, with someone as powerful as Matt and as educated as a sprinter, he doesn't move that head for anything that doesn't have purpose. So yes, he's getting air there. 